Hey, what's going on, Pisces? How are you? My name is Antoine, and I want to welcome you to your general energy reading for the week of September 11th through the 17th of 2022 uh, for all placements of Pisces, okay? Uh, 11th through 17th of September. We're going to go ahead and get right into the energies. Um, thank you all so much for your time. It's truly appreciated and valued. Uh, I really, really do. Thank you. All right, energies for Pisces. What's going on for Pisces here? September 11th through 17th. September. Pisces. All right, let's get one more good shuffle, you guys. So, Pisces, um, the challenge for the week here is the Princess of Cups. Okay. Um, wow. Pisces, I feel like there's... Uh, the first thing that came to my mind um, is like a creative block. Okay. There feels like there's some sort of process that you usually do when it comes to like your creative, you know, flow. Like your creative process, you know. Um, but for whatever reason, maybe it's, it feels blocked or it feels, you feel a little, maybe you feel uninspired. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, this is, this is really sticking out very clear. It's like, Spears, like, don't, there's no need to over explain it is there's a, a very uninspired energy that you're having this week. Okay. And it could, it could be maybe that it could be also that maybe you're a little underwhelmed with what it is that you have been able to create this week. Okay. So let's go ahead and pull some more energy here. We have the six of pentacles. Okay. We have the five of swords. Mm, okay. The three of wands. I see. I feel like maybe you are um, affected by certain stresses. Maybe stresses that have to do with, like, your family or just, like, you know, other personal or close people to you. Um, there's either some sort of fight or disagreement or, I don't know, something about something being unfair um, or someone feeling slighted, uh, where, you know, where they feel like it's like, you know, someone feels like they got the short end of something. Okay. I feel like you're trying to, I feel like you are trying to like work past that, move past that, uh, here with the three of wands. Like you're trying to, you're really trying hard not to focus on all of this, but it's really hard not to because it's really happening in your home. It's happening in the place where you really should feel the most comfortable. So then, yes, that's totally affecting how you're able to um, produce or how you're able to create when it comes to things outside of the home, whether it's like in your job or in your own personal creative projects. All right. Let's look under the deck here, Pisces. OK, so under the deck. Yeah. So we have the Ace of Wands. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. I, you know what? Spirit said that Pisces, there's somebody around you that's saying, well, why does Pisces get to da 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 da? Why, did, why is it that Pisces gets to blah blah blah? You know what I mean? Um, and maybe somebody is feeling like that is unfair. That Pisces gets to have a particular type of opportunity coming their way. It now, now, it, now it changes to Pisces where there's somebody that probably feels like you don't deserve it. There's somebody that probably feels like the work that you've done isn't creative enough. Why is your work getting recognized? Because it is. You know what I'm saying? So let's go ahead and look. <laughs> let's go ahead and pull. Yeah, we got the five of cups. We got the temperance. Okay. 
So I definitely see you having a very mature and level mind, level headedness about the situation, Pisces. Um, I almost think that in a way you do kind of feel a little guilty this week. There's the energy of feeling you feeling a little guilty all because I think maybe it does kind of get into your head a little bit. Like, why am I the one, you know? Why do I get to be blessed with a particular type of opportunity when there's other people around me that are also deserving? And the thing is, is that I, it's not like you don't think that the people around you are deserving. It's not even that you thought that you were less deserving, but you know that there are also other standout people in your circle or in your, you know, in your environment. However, it's you, Pisces, that has gotten the blessing to move forward or gotten the opportunity handed to them. Okay. And so there's probably an energy both where maybe on both sides, right, where you are like, OK, well, I have this energy or I have this opportunity. You know, why do I have this when there are also other gifted and talented people, you know, around me? And then other people are thinking like, well, ugh, why does Pisces get this opportunity when da 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 da? So you understand how it's like the two sided way, you know? Other people are thinking of it like they're feeling like it's unfair or they're coming from like a hater point of view almost. But then you're questioning it like, no, what is it about me that makes me so special? Do you understand? Okay, I see. Oh, I see. The Princess of Cups, the Page of Cups. Um, the Page of Cups, the Page of Swords, Six of Swords, the world. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, Pisces, I think I see what's going on. So, the reason it feels like, Pisces, that you may be feeling this way is the thing is, is that, yes, you are gifted, you are skilled, you are creative. Um, but there, I also feel like there are certain, um, there are certain, like, habits or there are certain things that you haven't really learned yet, which makes you more malleable. It makes you more moldable. Um, and I'm not saying that somebody is out there trying to mold you and shape you into, you know, their liking or whatever they want for you. That's not what I'm saying like that. What I mean is, is that like, because you don't have as much knowledge and as much experience, your talent is more raw. Because you don't have all of the necessary experience, right, that your counterparts do see their experience comes with like being set in their ways okay because it's always worked this way so they're going to continue to always do it that way da, 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 da. they're not open to new ideas but because you're fresh your talent is raw it can be you know you're more you're more able to be i get i mean yeah you're more able to be um open to learning like different approaches so that's why it gets to be you that carries the torch. Oh, wow. And then look at you carrying the torch right there into your next destiny. That's so crazy. <laughs> look, there you are carrying your wand right there. So that's why it gets to be you, Pisces. You don't have to feel guilty. It's to, it's to help, right? It's for you to come back and... Um, and be a help to the people around you and not necessarily like, but, but it's, it's hard for people to see that right now because all they see is an opportunity that Pisces is getting over them, but they don't see necessarily the reasons why. You understand? So let me go ahead and leave the messages there, Pisces, because I don't want it to turn negative because it's not negative at all. But let me know what's going on in the comment box below. Thank you guys so much for your time again. Um, make sure that you hit the like button and subscribe, and I'll see you all next week. Take care. Bye.